Hello everybody, welcome to my channel. In this episode, I want to explain about this platform called Lexica. This platform allows you to create an image just from the text. Or we can say that it is AI that can generate text for you. Hey. Sorry, an uh, artificial intelligence that generate text from image. Hey, sorry, an artificial intelligence that generate image from the text. Sorry, people, for confusions. Uh, this is my favorite platforms for creating a really, really realistic and nice artwork just from the text. Okay. As you can see on the screen, you will see many options, many pictures that generated from the user from this side. And also, there are uh, other source that are called stable diffusions. It's the other uh, source of image from uh, Source other source of image from stable diffusion 1.5. Stable diffusions 1.5 is an engine from stable diffusions platforms that we can search using Lexica website and to find what you want. And you can also search by image relevancy and by prompt text. Uh, I think we are. Uh, I think uh, maybe we we need to try this. Search for image. Okay. Maybe I want to try some uh, school image because I love Mortal Kombat. I love to see many scary uh, creatures. School. Uh, school of human maybe let's search for it and see what the result oh my god it's very unique and realistic you know what is that wow and this is the prom itself this is a text that gives the AI directions of what they should draw uh, in this platform so you can see this image generated from this text the anatomy of a by bizarre head made of junk food and also find detailed painting by James and also been traveler behind contest winner princess angular ultra modern surreal and this is the results you know it's very uh, Exactly, the results is uh, roughly same with the uh, with this prompts. You know, the anatomy of bizarre head. This bizarre is already bizarre, made of junk food. So that's why we can see many of ingredients of junk food here. And this is unique, bizarre, because it has some of what is that antenna out from the top of the head, and um, and you and you will generate uh, four options from this uh, from this uh, prompts. You know, the AI will give you four options by default. And you can choose one of them, of course. It's very, very interesting. You know, and it's realistic, you know. I tell you that this image generated from AI is a very, very unique. You, you, you'll never find image like this on the internet. So it's originally created by artificial intelligence. And they creatively in extrapolating the image, the colors, and 
uh, composition based on the prompts itself. So this is a very uh, authentic AI generated image that you never see on the internet. And you also see that this image is generated from Lexica Aperture version 2. This is a AI model that generated this image, you know. There are two models as I said before, you know, Lexica Aperture version 2 and Stable Diffusion. And this image created by Lexica Aperture version 2. And you'll see also a guidance scale. It represents the contrast of the image. If you if uh, it's a, around zero to ten, the higher value of the guidance scale, you'll see more contrast and dimensions. There are also dimensions that determine how the aspect ratio and the orientations of the image. In this case, you see the this is a uh, portrait orientations and it can it, it was upscaled to, to 2048 pixels and 3072 pixels it's very very high resolutions negative from you will see oversaturated low rest negative from means that a result that you want to avoid during the process of AI generating image for you. So you know that AI sometimes can generate the uh, variations that randomly generated without our control so they can creatively uh, make a new outcome that's off from our prompt. So to avoid that, we can insert some words into a negative prompts. In this case, we'll see oversaturated, low rest, blurry, bad anatomy, poorly drawn face, ugly blur, out of focus, and long neck. And this is the result. An amazing image of school with the junk food on it okay i think you you understand about the uh how this works and uh let's try to generate image let's see uh i was trying to generate before but i i i don't see uh this uh, platform generate image from me. So let's try again and generate image. I want to make an astronaut in a jungle. Basic man color palette. I got this from the previous, from the other users that I I found it on the search on the search uh, features like we said before but it seems that this platform generates uh, image in a very long time it takes a long time to generate image I'm not sure what the problem is but maybe I I exhausted all of my quotes of you know my monthly quotes from uh, how many images that I can generate to this month. There are limited images generated to this month. I got only 100 images per month in the free plans. And maybe, maybe I was hit the limit so we, so I cannot uh, create the other pictures. Okay. Uh, maybe you can try it self and I just want to explain to you about how it works, uh, you know, in these functions. 
uh, first we see the dimensions as we as I said before dimension means that how uh, aspect ratio of your image uh, if we slide to the center it, it will form like a square and we uh, pull it to the right and you will see a portrait and portrait and the left is horizontal or landscape and there are advanced setting here as I said before guidance scale is the parameter that determine the contrast of your image so if you want to neutral you can just put this into 7 or 8 you know uh, the more contrast means that your uh, pictures going more uh, saturated maybe or with a very high level more contrast you know? the contrast means the difference between dark and brightest uh, colors it's it has a very distinct views into the image itself but I'm not sure I'm I never use this uh, and I just maybe set it at 7 and 8 and the other features that you will consider fixed double heads fixed double head means that you know sometimes this AI generate uh, of variations that 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 in the real life makes it so uh, off from the reality like uh, double heads and crops and you know slows and sometimes like a string anatomy I got recently draw a hand that got a six finger instead of five so that's uh, a I cannot uh, different differentiate between the real life situations and of what they can uh, create the variations of thing so that's maybe it's improvement but by fix these double heads we can fix all of those problems we can check this and generate. it but currently it's, it's still not working okay you can also put negative from here as i said before negative from is things that you want to avoid from the results I I I was create several images before. As you can see, I create the image of Donald Trump in Bulubudur and Donald Trump as Spider-Man, but it's it, I'm not sure where the Donald Trump is. And this is the creator's art from my side. This is the Celine Dion as a spider-man <laughs> this is a kind of like a, a queen of spider-man <laughs> in a parabudur but what is that the pictures of spider-man it has a it has a spider-man statue on the top of this uh, temple this makes no sense at all but the face is really realistic it resembles the uh, face of San Indian exactly as the real life and they use some strange uh, costume Sp uh, spider-man sorry spider-man but with a string of custom the, the string logo spider-man this is the string variation that uh, sometimes of AR artificial creates in their uh, 
image is uncontrolled result we need to fix it manually if you want to use this image as to becoming more and more uh, perfect you have to edit it a bit maybe I got for spider-man okay I hope you enjoy this video and you understand and you can try this lexical arts or oh, I I have some information for you if you want to increase uh, you can choose if you want to increase the words of how many image you can create in this platform you can choose monthly plans from starter to max from ten ten dollar per month to six hundred six sixty dollar per month and from year for year depends if you want to do with this platforms in the long run you can choose a um, yearly plan you know build annually at six ninety six per year it saves our money for a uh, long run instead of money plans okay I hope you understand about this and you can try lexical arts and you can try free maybe free yes free you have 100 uh, pictures if, if you want to use this as a business or something productive you can choose the plants Okay, that's all. I hope you understand what what I speaking with that I talking about. Uh, I hope you can understand and let's play with AI arts. Let's generate some uh, amazing arts that can uh, gives us a creativity and more more. Uh, involved into the into this technology and we can understand and we can uh, use this technology to our life to improve our life and improve our business and all positive impact that may comes out from this uh, platforms okay guys see you next time take care